Welcome one and all, I'm Decoy, and today we're going to be checking out all three of the new items in the Atomic Shop. The Lookout slash Watchtower, the Classic Performance Stage, and the Boxing Ring. So each of these are 700 atoms each, which in my mind I went, it's kind of weird that there's not like a little bundle where you could get all three slightly cheaper, but uh, I don't know. But we are going to go through, check out each one of them, because when they, they put their little pictures in the in the Atomic Shop, it seems like they don't really do them justice sometimes. So I want to go in, we'll take a look at each of them, and maybe to help you determine if it's really worth getting, and I'll be able to point out some of the things that kind of bug me about them. So let's go ahead, hop over into the game, and we'll start taking a look at them. All right, first up, we got the Watchtower. Now, this one I'm kind of excited about, but there is one thing that does slightly bug me. I'm trying to get it over here by this truck so you can kind of understand the scale of it. I mean, it is pretty freaking big. It is nowhere near as tall as, say, a Watchtower out in the world, but I, I understand that. So, I've got it slapped down, and I hold on. Alright, I was being harassed by some mole rats and a beepy guy, so I had to deal with that. But now onto the watchtower. I think the first thing that really bugs me is the concrete foundation underneath it. I, I really hate having concrete underneath the structures that they release. I, I kind of understand why it's there, but it does bug me a little bit. Of course, the watchtower... Pretty much like a watchtower you'd find out in the world, except undecorated. And I'm cool with that. So overall, my only major negative that I'm seeing on this one, on like a quick little first walkthrough, is the giant concrete foundation at the bottom. And I don't know if you... Oh, stupid mole rats, man. They gotta harass us during videos. But, if you caught it when I was looking at building it, it says you could build up to six of them and given the size of them six watchtowers is pretty freaking impressive all right now we got this kind of reset a little bit let's go find the stage first thing i'm noticing is that you're limited to one of them which uh, bums me out really really much like so bad because this was probably the piece that I, I was looking forward to the most. Just because it it fits the world and I could see using it for multiple purposes if I could have more than one. Don't get me wrong, it's a pretty cool stage. But there is one major issue. And that's with the lights. You think, oh, maybe you can only build one because of the lights. Well, I got news for you. The lights don't work. Of course, it doesn't require any power to place it, but I've also put down a generator, tried attaching power straight to it. The lights don't work. And that... That just sucks so bad. I love the piece. It looks awesome. Now, another minor issue with it, it's going to be with it wanting to kind of float slightly. You know, where you, you place it and half of it's just hanging off and it just looks really awkward. Now, there are ways that you could use that to your benefit, depending on how you're building. But that can also be a major downside at the same time. Now, let's get over to the boxing ring. Now, first thing of note, you can only build one of these. Which also has me wondering, huh... How is it the two smaller items of the three you can only build one of, but you get six watchtowers? Uh, to be fair, I'm still a little bit, uh, a little bit bummed out about the last one, so... Ah, uh, well, I don't know. Now, when it comes to the ring, of course you've got to be careful where you place it down, because some items may, like the dirt, may stick through it. The ring itself, overall, pretty darn nice. But I did notice one key thing when I went to build it and when I was looking at it in the Atomic Shop. 
and that is that the name of it is Clean Boxing Ring. Which leads me to wonder, does that mean we're going to get a, a dirty variant or a non-clean version of it down the road, either through the Atomic Shop or actually in-game? Because I, I kind of want to see that version of it more than a clean version. So, I don't have any major downsides to that one. But that's the three of them. I mean, is it really worth buying for you? I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. The Watchtower is pretty darn cool, and you can build six of them. But that's going to wrap this one up. I hope you've enjoyed it. Please remember to like, sub, and share. Later.